And my love, beautiful souls of Mystic Rose of Love Loving, I'm back with Trooper in the Dark and Light. Please take what resonates and leave your does not fit for somebody else's collective message, okay? So I'm going to start with the channeling. Um, I actually channeled this in the way to register today. And um, I might pull some cards as well. But I was going to channel and then I, I actually was recording it and it didn't record. So, okay, so this message is a message from a male masculine, okay? A male masculine. I'm hearing divine male masculine, okay? Um, they are sending telepath, telepath messages towards me and they want this message to be heard from you, okay? Um, you, you are somebody that watches tarot, you're somebody that watches spiritual, um, channels and stuff like that, and there, this, this is a significant message for you, okay? This is not a karmic, okay? This is not a karmic, this is not a demon, this is not a lower vibrational being, this is a divine masculine or a masculine that has grown, okay? That has grown, that ultimately has unconditional love and is walking the path of God, okay? Is walking the path of God that is having faith, is working on themselves, but this, this, what I'm hearing is this divine masculine or masculine loves you unconditionally, okay? And this is male masculine. Uh, loves you unconditionally, would do anything for you, would go to the other side of the world to make things right for you and stuff, okay? Or go across the world, however that saying is, okay? Um, they would, they would die for you. They take a bullet for you, okay? They, they absolutely love you. You're the first one that they truly 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 love they've had many many lovers in the past many many relationships but you are the ultimate true love okay your ultimate true love um in the past he they thought this masculine thought it was a love but it was more lust it was more attraction it was more um codependence relationship as well i'm hearing codependence relationship okay um you needed they needed somebody and that person needed them so it was more codependence okay but this masculine, this masculine, um, has, I'm hearing this masculine has been, you may feel like this masculine has been pushing you away or been ignoring you or been, um, not their themselves. It's because that they have inner conflict, inner, um, inner, um, in, inner insecurities as well that they're trying to work on, that they're trying to fix and they're trying to still catch up with you. Okay. Cause you are a divine feminine that the most divine feminines wake up before the masculine. And as divine feminines, we wake up and like we're, we're ahead of the masculines and it takes it takes a while for the masculines to catch up. And if you just like high school, when you're in high school, what happens? More of the females or like you could be 16 and that masculine, that, that your boyfriend could be 16, but you're more mature than that 16-year-old boy, okay? Females are usually more mature. And the same thing as divine feminines usually wake up and usually heal, usually grow before divine, before masculines, okay? So they're still trying to catch up. They're still trying to work on themselves. Um, I'm also hearing this masculine... Um, this male masculine feels like they're not as important to you as you are to them. Okay. It feels like you are not as important to, they're not as important to you as they are to you are to them. Okay. So what I'm hearing is you could, um, be working a lot. You could be doing things on your own. You could be spending time with your friends. You could be, you know, just doing something that, um, makes them feel like that there's some like i said because insecurities making them feel like that um you don't care about them as much as they care about you but i'm hearing that you do care about, about as much as them but you you're doing your own thing okay that's what i'm hearing divine feminine you're doing your own thing you're making sure that you are um growing healing and on your path and your journey and you're you're allowing things to come as in like you're not chasing you're not chasing okay so i'm hearing you're not chasing you're not you're not trying to force something, okay? I'm hearing you're trying not to force something. Um, but this, again, this masculine really, really loves you unconditionally. And if you're watching this and you're on here and you're like, well, that's not, that's my, my, no, my DM is cheating on me. My DM is lying. They're sneaking around. They're talking to this person, talking to this person. This reading's not for you then because a DM, that's not what DM, everyone thinks, oh, my DM, DM me. Because you got the DM, like on Messenger and all that stuff. Oh, I got DM. That is not a DM, okay? A divine masculine, a DM is a divine masculine. Or DF is divine feminine, okay? Divine masculine. Somebody that's walking the path of God. Somebody that's a faith. Somebody that has awoken. Somebody that is healing, okay? You could be, a, or a masculine, okay? If if you're on here and you're saying, well, this person's doing this, this person's doing that, and like still out running the streets, still out lying, cheating, um, manipulating, trying to control the situation, control the relationship, not wanting to communicate, not wanting to talk, that is not a DM, okay? That is not the person I'm talking about in this reading, okay? So this reading would not be for you, okay? Because this is somebody that truly, truly loves somebody, truly, truly cares for somebody, truly, truly wants to make things work with somebody, and like 
is doing everything possible for them to grow and heal and catch up. But they have a lot of work to do. I'm hearing that this person could be also talking to a preacher, okay, or a pastor, or a therapist, or a coach. They could be talking to somebody, okay? They could be getting um, guidance from somebody. They could even be seeing a, 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 a relationship therapist, you know, a relationship coach, okay? But I'm, I'm hearing they're going to God as well. This person's going right to God and asking God how to help with their relationship. Or they could be watching relationship videos, okay? They could be watching relationship videos, how, and like working on themselves, okay? So this, this energy I'm pulling, they are really working on themselves. They're really, really trying to better themselves. They're really, really trying to make, because what I'm hearing is they want to make your dreams come true. They want to give you the world. They want to make everything possible for you. They want to see you happy, joyful, full light, enlightenment, all that stuff. They, want, they, they just want to see so much good things for you and for them. And so they're working on themselves and they're trying to work on those inner conflicts, the insecurities, their demons, okay? They're trying, they're working on their demons, okay? But not in a bad way like they're, because I am a divine feminine and I still have demons, okay? I still work on demons every day. One demon is to make sure I don't smoke a cigarette and also go back to sex addiction and also go back to methamphetamines and stuff like that. So every day I'm still like, working on my demons making sure that i i am staying where i need to be okay so that's what this mask was doing and there could be something to this mask i'm also hearing this divine mask is going through a dark night of soul okay so they're trying to figure out what they want because i'm hearing what they want in the past is not what they want now okay so this masculine what they want in the past is not what they want is not what they want now so this ma pa masculine in the past was taking a different path than what they are now. And now they're trying to find themselves. They're trying to find their purpose. They're trying to find, um, discover what they truly want. But one thing they want, they know 100% is they want you. Okay? They know they want you. But they're trying to figure out what else they want. Like their purpose, their mission, their, their, their life is supposed to be about with you in it. Okay? With you in it. Okay? Um, I'm hearing this person may want to have children with you or they have children and they want, they want to have a family together. They want to grow. I'm hearing they, you know, they, and I'm, this is the thing too, is this masculine may want to, um, for some reason I'm pulling that this masculine wants to be more involved with you, it, um, do things with you, spend time with you and, um, communicate more better with you properly okay and so that could be why they're going reaching out to a source of a therapist for this help okay for this guidance um i'm hearing that this masculine also could have seen a mother and father have a good relationship and they want to give that to you okay they want to give that to you they want to have unity okay they want to have unity they want to leave the past behind them okay they want to leave the past behind them they don't want some if you're bringing up past they want you to leave the past behind them they are woke, okay? They are woke. There's confirmation masculine. They are woke. They are going this transformation. That's why. They're not trying to push you away. They're not trying to shut you out. They're not trying to ignore you. They're not trying to ghost you, okay? They're going through this transformation, Pluto energy. They're needing you to be patient with them, okay? And I'm hearing God is showing this. They need, because they're trying to take care of themselves first. They're trying to get their energy back. I'm hearing they're calling you back at their energy, power and energy that was taken from them. Okay, this masculine, their power and energy was taken from them. So they're calling it back. They're taking care of themselves. They're, this person may be trying to relax, trying to um, figure out what they really want, okay? Uh, mind, body, and soul. They're on balance, very, very unbalanced in the past. And they're trying to get that balance out, okay? Wow, see? Yeah, they're trying to go with the flow. They're trying to get stable, stable, okay? And the stable, they're trying to root themselves, get grounded, okay? Structure, build a structure, stability, okay? But stability doesn't always come from material items. Stability means that they're trying to get their, I'm hearing mental health in control, okay? Their mental health in control. This mask can be vulnerable, very vulnerable, okay? Okay, so like you could be more of the strong one, like... So when I'm pulling from this energy, is you, this is a divine masculine, but this this divine masculine embodies more feminine energy, and you could be a divine feminine, but embody more masculine energy, okay? And so like very nurturing, loving, kind, but they could be very vulnerable too, and they want they will they want they want they want to be needed and wanted just like you want to be needed and wanted, okay? Yeah, they're remembering who they are now, okay? They're remembering who they are, and remember divine feminine. What you have to remember, put your shoes put your shoes in their 
put your feet in their shoes. You once were going through that, okay? You once were going through that awakening. You once were going through that confusion. You once were going through the inner conflict, inner um, torment, torment, turmoil, turmoil. You were once going through that, okay? You once were going through that. Now they are, okay? Renewal spark. Because they're, they're awakening to remember. Remember when, do you go back to Divine Feminine when you were all confused? Like everything was going on, you know, you didn't know what was happening. You were so confused. You were so out of it. And like, you just didn't have anyone get you or understand you. Okay, you felt alone. That's what this mask is. Mask may be feeling alone right now too, because he, they're they're going through a spiritual awakening. They're 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 transforming, and it's 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 hard. It's hard. Okay. They pro I'm hearing this mask may feel like they're losing their mind. They feel like they're losing their mind. They're going crazy, but they're not. Okay, they're going through spiritual awakening. Their higher self is being activated. Their higher self is helping them remember. Okay, so they do. They may fight. May try to push you away or um, make feel like you you're not like they're not. They're not there, or they love you, but they do. I'm hearing they do love you, okay? They could be in some kind of regret. See, they could be in regret, okay? Regret's a low fear, okay? Regret. Yeah, reunion. Okay, this is a reunion, soul tie. They love you. Somebody's bringing up memories, remembering the past, okay? Cycles are closing, changing, changing. Completion. Activating their higher self. The fall. They're walking away from this, okay? They're, they're, they're trying to slow down. This masculine's trying to slow down their life, okay? They could have been a party animal. So I'm hearing they're giving up their bachelor bachelor ways, okay? That's what I'm hearing. Giving up their bachelor ways to be with you, okay? They once they could have been a bachelor before, or they could have been just a player ways. That's what I'm hearing, player ways. They're giving it up to be with you because they ultimately love you, Okay? They would walk the earth, world for you. They walk the earth for you, okay? They would take a bullet for you. They no longer want to separate from you, okay? They're longing. They're longing to come home to their higher self. They're longing to come home to union with you. They're trusting the divine. And something's big going to happen in winter time. Okay, so autumn in the winter. Jupiter, this is a new beginning, okay, for this masculine. New beginning. This masculine's having courage to stand up, okay? Speak his truth. That's what I'm hearing too. This masculine has been afraid to speak the truth. Okay, because I'm hearing they could have been put down many, many, um, many times in the past. Been put down. So they're ready to speak the truth now. The ocean. See, they would go to the ocean for you. They would, they would, they would leave to go do something for you. They would, they would dive into the ocean. If you were sinking in the ocean, they would dive in the ocean. So they want water energy too. They're very emotional. Okay, this is very sensitive, emotional, masculine as well. Grandma, grandma could be trying to communicate with you. Crone energy. Okay, grandma energy. Grandma's been trying to deliver this message to you, trying to get your attention. Yeah, see, this is the lovers. Your grandma's telling you this is your lover. Okay. This was guided by the ancestors, guided by God, orchestrated by God. This relationship was meant to happen. It's meant for you, okay? For the underworld, okay? Something's trying to pull this masculine down into the underworld, try to bring him back. He could have been part of the underworld, leaving the underworld behind, okay? I'm hearing he's leaving the underworld behind. Because he's got, because God has went within him. him. God's within him, okay? God is within him. Love. Warrior. You're a warrior. He's a warrior. This mask is a warrior. Okay, he's been fighting. I'm hearing he could be a defender too. Defender of people. If he doesn't know that yet, he may not know his purpose, but he's a defender. He's a warrior. He is to help fight for humanity. The gem. He might not see it, but he sees you as a gem. He sees you as a diamond. He sees you as... The beautiful star, okay? He sees you as the gem. The brightest gem in the sky. The brightest star in the sky. Knowledge. Truth being revealed. Ancient truth being revealed. Okay? And that could be why. That could be why this masculine could be um, feeling this way. This masculine could be a healer too. Okay, this could be this could be a twin flame or a higher level soulmate.
They want to blend families. Take me home tonight. They want to take you home tonight. Okay? They want to be with you. Okay, somebody wants to cuddle. Somebody likes cuddling. They're the one. Somebody likes cuddling. Or you holding them, them holding you. The electric touch. Okay, somebody could get goosebumps. Likes touching you. Holding hands. Okay. Electrifying. Soulmate, soul contract. This is so this is divinely guided, okay? This is divinely orchestrated. They are the future. This mask is a for the future. I just keep saying I'm hearing unconditional love for you, okay? They they love you more than more than you know. Okay. They may not be able to show you the right way, but they're trying. They're, they're trying. They want to be a better man. They want to be a better version. They want to be a better person. Not just a man, not not a man, not a boyfriend. They want to be a better person, a better human, okay? That's what I'm hearing. They want to be a better human. This mask wants to be a better human. This mask wants to do the, uh, the right thing. Love is closer than you think, okay? Love is closer than you think. They could be a bad boy, okay? So, they could still be divine masculine, but be a bad boy, okay? Bad boy in the sheets, you know? Think about that. Bad boy. Thank you. I miss you more than life, so maybe maybe this person's overseas. Maybe this person's gone, traveling, working, okay? And they miss you, okay? They miss you. You turn me on badly. And it's meant to be. Patience, patience, patience. I just keep hearing patience is the key. Okay, patience is the key. Patience is the key and trust, 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 trust. Trust that everything's going to work out, okay? God will, I'm hearing God's not going to put this person in your life because you divine feminine. This God's not going to put this person in your life if you raise your vibration. You're aligned with this person, okay? And that's why this person's doing this. You could cry for them, they could cry for you, but or we have somebody that's in the... Uh, King and Queen of Cups in my feelings. You guys could just be in your feelings, okay? Both be very sensitive, intuitive, okay? I'm here very sensitive and um, nurturing, loving. So now you gotta give this love back to one another. And I, I'm hearing you guys are very, you love other people too, like the world, okay? Abundance, sudden wealth, unexpected income, gratitude, accept all positive outcomes. People are gonna try to stop this. They're fighting for you. Okay, this is King and Queen of Wands. My passion is undesirable for you. Like they're fighting for you. Find the spiritual realm. They, I'm hearing they like they would they stick up for you. They would do anything for you. Okay, they do anything for you. Um. Yeah. They would take a charge for you. They're nonchalant. Somebody could be nonchalant, too. I don't know, like, nonchalant, quiet. Win or lose, they're going to win it, okay? Win or lose it, okay? Oh, and that's what I'm saying. Is there's going to be people that are going to try to be villains, try to stop this relationship, okay? Because they don't want you to be true. They don't want you to have true love. This is true love, okay? This is real true love, okay? I know we watch all these tarot readings. We put these tarot readings on. It's always karmic. It's always negative, And there's always murder and drugs and um, fights and People doing black magic, but this this energy is love. This comes from unconditional love, 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 like true, real love. Okay, there was an entanglement. Okay, as I said, somebody could be trying to entanglement. Somebody's trying to cause some kind of drama in this life. Okay, somebody's trying to cause some stir up some drama. Okay, spiritual warfare, uh, psychic attacks on this relationship as well. Because they see you're happy, they see you guys happy. Um, could be happy. There could be some kind of receipts. Evidence. Okay, I don't know what's okay. Something about yeah coming up. There, this is a twin flame. Phone records, text records, photos, evidence, documents. Don't think it's true. Proof in the pudding. I don't know why this receipt's coming. I feel like somebody's gonna try to um, somebody's gonna try to. What's going on with this receipts? What's going on with this receipts, spirit? What's going on with receipts? You're gonna see. Okay. Somebody, I feel like that's really weird. Like, somebody from your past could, like, try to have some receipts or try to say something. But this is a past. So I'm hearing, let the past be bygones, okay? 
Pay to commit some kind of receipts or some kind of evidence in the past. Whatever's happened in the past is past, but by begun by be begun. This masculine's a new masculine. This is a new masculine. Okay? What he did in his past is in his past. His player ways is in his past. His bachelor ways is in his past. His street life is in his past. And he's no longer that person anymore. Okay? He's he's not that person anymore. You have to let this past be behind. Um, or there could be some kind of receipts of something else as well. Okay, because we have twin flame, you are my soul to infinity beyond my mirror and same chemistry. Somebody sees through this, okay? Okay, sees through this. Um, vision, clairvoyance, imagination, and self doubt. See, you could have had self doubt about this relationship, or this masculine could have had self doubt about this relationship, or like I said, self sabotage and denial, fear. I'm not good enough. You're not good enough for me because masculine, logical. Some of you felt like they were not good enough for one another, but they are passionate about you. They love you. They absolutely, absolutely love you. I'm passionate about you. Okay, so that's what they had is somebody had to heal from addiction. They're walking away from addiction, codependencies, drugs, alcohol, codependency, pill popper, lean, my habits are affecting me. They're walking away from this, okay? Somebody has snakes around them. Be careful. See, I'm here not see like I'm on this reading, I'm just channeling. See, that's the thing, is I'm on this channeling and now like I'm I'm some energy. It's trying to come through some karmic energy so that could be happening too so there could be some kind of interference some kind of like somebody's trying to interfere in this masculine's life okay trying to bring this masculine back into a chimeric cycle okay so you what you what you need to do is pray for your masculine pray for this divine masculine keep praying praying for yourself praying for this relationship praying that your this relationship is protected because the relationship is protected but somebody's literally literally trying to interfere in this relationship trying to interfere trying to bring the someone's trying to make the masculine go back to old ways Okay. And I'm hearing like this masculine still new um is still vulnerable. Okay. Still vulnerable to um toxic energies, karmic energies. Um could fall back in old traps, that's what I'm hearing too, okay? So something somebody's trying to some something something or someone is trying to Trap this masculine again, okay? Try to trap this masculine so this masculine, um, why well, I put all these cards too? Everything will be okay, okay? Um, try to trap this masculine so this masculine is unable to come towards you because what I'm hearing too is divine feminine. If you are at the vibration you are, you have to have. You're another person at that vibration. You are not going to be able to be with somebody that's a lower vibration. You're not going to be able to be with somebody that's a karmic lover, okay? Um, Because your vibration is too high. So um, if this interference, this psychic attack on this masculine, what they're trying to do is they're trying to trap him and lower his vibration, his frequency, because then he would not be able to come in alignment with you and um, you guys be together. So they're, they're trying to interfere in that, okay? Um, But I'm hearing that you are protected, that you guys will come in alignment and you guys will be together. So if you're not together, you will be together, okay? You will be together. I'm here and putting a finger on it, okay? Somebody's ready to put a finger on it. Or a ring on the finger. It could be... I, I was hearing an earth energy. I kept hearing grounded stability, so it could be an earth sign. Um, I'm also hearing a fire sign. Okay. They could be any signs. Oh, water sign too, because I saw the water coming out. So yeah, it could be, you know what I mean? Like, the only thing I can say, errors, telepathy. So yeah, it could be any sign. And so I could, I'll do the zodiac signs, but. They love you, okay? They love you. They absolutely love you. If someone's trying to bring this mass plan back into... A karmic cycle, karmic energy. Oh, let's like this. Close this out. You guys, check out my Etsy store. 25% off, free shipping handling. Dream Mystical. Also, for the month of September, I have a special going on. $25.25 for a 15 to 25 minute pre-recorded video. If you want to check that out. You can email me at dreammystical.lc at gmail.com or go to my description box and click the link, okay? My link tree. Okay, let's close this out for the collective engagement. Wow. Engagement. 
your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other, okay? So open communication. Discuss, because somebody's trying to make that interfering, okay? They're trying to um, block that, okay? They're trying to interfere. You're calling your soulmate. Your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help you bring, in your, bring them together. Wedding. This is, situation involves marriage. And they are worth waiting for the bottom. Divine timing is at work in your love life. Okay. So open communication, heart to heart. Somebody can be writing letters back and forth, emails back and forth. You could be getting DMs from them. They can't get your smell out. So like they they smell you everywhere, okay? Like they smell you. And I'm just showing this person just wants to bone you. Nonstop just wants to bone you. They can't get enough of you. You're mystical. Trust transformation occurs through acceptance. Once you accept the current situation, it will automatically transform. My beloved, though we may be physically apart, spiritually we are always united. For love transcends space and time. Nothing is missing. Oh, so if this is it, this is they could be in 5D. Okay, telepathy. May have not been manifested, but they can feel you. You love them. One more. Wow, no, nope, it's Twin Flames. Your passion ignites. This is Twin Flame. Playfulness, laughter is the best therapy. Have some fun together and remember love is the greater healer. Love is greater healer. So this is unconditional love, you guys. Okay, unconditional love. Unconditional love. And sacred union. Honor and treasure your relationship for it's truly sacred. This is sacred, okay? This is sacred. This is, this is sacred. Twin Flames. Nine eleven is a twin flame number. Angels are close to you. They are protecting you and helping you achieve your goals. Soulmate twin flame connection. Trust connection. Highly karmic and spiritual. Encourages you to pursue soul mission as light worker. Fifteen fifteen. Change opportunities coming into your life. Love romance and pay attention. You guys, I wasn't gonna do names. The spirit to Remy told me the name because this is a love reading and somebody wants to hear some names. How about I don't mess this up with the with the some other things in here. I took 17. We have Lika, Latoya, Jackie. Who you think is your best friend is your enemy. So the enemy is what's trying to stop you and your twin flame or your relationship, okay? Trying to stop this masculine. Your um, your best so-called best friend is the one that's trying to block this relationship, okay? Trying to block this or trying to make this masculine go back into a dark energy, okay? Um, Manchester. Northern, Northern, Northumberland. Northumberland. Tamaria. Lyle, Mexico, karmic energy. So yeah, there's karmic energy that's trying to stop this, okay? Rolex, or your masculine's walking away from karmic energy, okay? Rolex, Kingston, state trooper. Someone could be a state trooper or dealing with a state trooper. Aphrodite, beauty, sex, love, you. That's what this person sees you as, Aphrodite. Beauty, love, sexuality, okay? Loving, caring. They see you as Aphrodite. Ohio, Illuminati. Okay, somebody could be walking with Illuminati. Nobody, it's something about Illuminati. Illuminati keeps watching. Wifey, you are mine. So they're already calling you wifey if you're not married. Aubrey, Holly, Zeus. Something about real estate. They want to buy some real estate with you. Pearsons. Someone could drive a tinted window. Vehicle. Downey. Greta. Money laundering movie set productions. Okay, somebody could have been involved in this or know about this. Karmic energy is coming out. Trying to come out. Baltimore. Time to expose the government. So this could be your purpose, your masculine's purpose, somebody's ex purpose to expose the government. Okay, I don't know why it's, it's coming out in this reading now. I think it's probably coming out because in these cities and stuff. 
Okay. Wow, some, yeah, shout out, shout out agency. So somebody looks like they're being watched as well. Okay, you'll be watched. Okay, twin flames are being watched, you guys. Okay, if you're a true twin flame, you do have um people in the shadow watching you, okay? Trouble. Someone tried to cause some trouble in your life, okay? Somebody's literally trying to cause some trouble in your life. Okay? They're trying to cause chaos, trouble in your life. Stella, Leo, this was a major life lesson. And Gabrielle, so whatever you're going through, whatever this mask is going through, it's a major life lessons, okay? Major, major life lessons. Somebody's ready to move away with you, too. Like, I'm here to move states or countries to be with you. So this could be overseas. Somebody could have met somebody overseas, okay, over online. And they're ready to, like, move cross-country with you. So maybe you haven't even met one another in person and they are just met online. And they're ready to move cross-country with you. Or a state-to-state -state or, you know, just get up and leave. I'm hearing, like, because now I'm hearing the Fast Car song by Luke Holmes now. But it used to actually, Tracy was singing Tracy Chapman. It's better, song's better than Tracy Chapman. But I'm also hearing, like, that song Fast Car. Okay? Getting the Fast Car, like, that's why I'm hearing right now. Are we going to get away? Are you and this person going to get away from everything that you no longer want to be involved with? Like, walking away from it. Like, actually letting it all go by. Like, gone. Like, bye-bye. Like, bye. Like, I'm hearing NSYNC now. Bye-bye. You know? Are you are you ready to get away? Go away in the fast car and start a new life. Because this, I'm hearing this masculine absolutely wants to start a new life with you. Doesn't want... I'm here wants to cut every single person off from your past. Um, if not, is this person, this masculine, is just ready to leave. Of, and everything just to be with you. Okay? Just to be with you. Because that's how much love they have for you. It's like, it's it's electrifying. Like, I'm I'm hearing like their, how their heart beats. It's like nothing else. Like, they don't feel alive without you. Like, so if, even if you didn't, met, I'm hearing somebody, somebody meeting on somebody on, online. Okay? You met somebody online and like, you never physically met, like physically met, but when you're online and, like, you don't talk to that person for a day or two or, like, you're busy working and you don't see that, like, you feel like you're dying inside. You feel like you just need to be that person. Like, you, you're, like, you, you're missing your other half. You're missing something of you. Okay? And that's what I'm hearing is, like, that's what you're going to get up and just, like, up and leave and go and be with this person. Because when you're not with this person, you feel like you're missing that other half of you. And that's what true soulmates can be like. You know, I mean, twin flames are like, but soulmates too. Like, you're looking for your other half, the other person of you, the other version of you. So, yeah. And I think it's beautiful what I just heard. Like, I really do. I really think that. And I really, I'm what I'm hearing is this masculine them really working on themselves. Um, really figuring out who they are. If not, this masculine just has their life together. And they're just, they just want to be with you. They just want to, they want marriage. You know, they want marriage. You know, they want it. You guys, not all men are bad. Not all men are bad. There are wonderful, wonderful men out there. There are wonderful, wonderful women out there that do not cheat, do not lie, do not steal, do not do anything. There are wonderful divine beings out there. Okay? Wonderful. And they, they also watch Tarot too. Leo, Cancer, Sagittarius, Pisces, and number three. I love you. Love, peace, light, healing, namaste.